all right guys this is bank nifty and 15 minute chart uh, first you can see in bank nifty in 15 minute chart in uh, is running in a downtrend so we have seen all moving averages are arranging sequentially and still they are running in a downtrend all right so if you want to see in the large time frame let, uh, let me check it h4 or daily we have seen there are forming a different pattern here uh, first we have seen price uh, just drop to this level and again reverse back and again we have seen price just uh, drop down but uh, they failed to break the previous lower point now they are trying to create a new lower high so what is the meaning of new lower high so means uh, first uh, they create a new low lower low you can say uh, this is the lower low and price reverse back again or you can say price pull up right so next when they attempt to break this level this lower point but they fail now they are trying to create a new higher high right so once they create a new higher high it will recognize it as a new lower low but still we are not confirmed so most of the people are say this is a double bottom pattern yeah this is a double bottom pattern and uh, some people say w pattern yeah that is also right so still they are under construction so now in that case we must find out the range of this market what is the range of this market let me show some uh, support and resistance line so according to our rule uh, we are looking for most the nearest swing point so where is the most nearest swing point here so why I'm not placing here? So I need the multiple rejection. What is the multiple rejection are there? So in that area, we have seen multiple rejection again and again. They, they are trying to break this level. And then similarly here, and a little more above that was tail or you can say shadow. So you can use like a range of this market, but I'm placing a single line out there. And now we have seen that is the very uh, resistant line. And then now let me draw the support. So here we drawn as a support. All right. Now we have seen this is the major market range. So in between these range, we must trade. All right. Now let's just jump to small time frame. H1. So H1 we have seen it should look like that. Right. They have uh, they failed to create a new lower low. Right. That was previous lower low. And when price retraced, they failed now today you can see price just open a gap up and we are expecting price will push up toward this level around 20,000 or you can say exactly 21,000 that that is the round figure right 21,000 that is the rate or you can say raise the line so we are expecting for few days it will run like that all right but i'm not 100 percent sure nobody can forecast predict the market all right so we are expecting it is a probability all right now if you want to enter for the sale we must wait to break this level right if price break this level so we can we will go for short again and here we have seen two opportunity for the sell. so first we have seen this is a sell opportunity if price break this lower point remember the lower point is one six uh, seven zero zero means sixteen thousand seven hundred that is the supporting range so we are looking for short after breaking this supporting line All right that is the first and the next we have seen there is a range a resistance line around twenty thousand or twenty one thousand that is the another range so we are looking for short in this area once the appear sell signal All right don't enter blindly once they appear below 21,000, so we are looking for short. All right now, question is that can I, can we buy? Definitely, that is a buy opportunity. So once they appear buy signal, right now don't uh, don't jump and blindly enter in this market. All right, I'll show you exactly what is the entry point. So we are looking for buy above this supporting line right now you can see price are above this supporting line so we are looking for a buy signal all right this is the first buy opportunity and another above 21,000. that will be another buy opportunity 
Now let me show you in a small time frame like 15 minutes. So in 15 minutes, uh, here we have seen price following moving average 150. Have you seen? Have you got it? Price broke this level, create a new low point. Uh, okay, in this area, hit this 150 moving average, which is blue color. You have you seen? Uh, that is the blue color. That is the 150 exponential moving average. Hit and reverse back. First, there was respecting. That means uh, this is called market behavior. They are respecting. First, we need bounce back, right? So next, again, the hit. 150 exactly here exponential moving average again bounce from moving average 150 now you can see here price just approaching toward 150 moving average so what i told we are looking for buy right so where is the buy anti point do you think this is right now the buy anti point absolutely not this is not a buy opportunity so in that case we are looking for a breakout so here we have seen 150 moving average, but we are looking for by above 200 exponential moving averages. Where is the 200 moving average? So somewhere here. So we are looking for buy once break this 200 exponential moving average. That is our buy opportunity and target will be somewhere here around 21,000. That is the telling strategy so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and thanks for watching